Hey Turbinex, it's Monday, August 4th, and uh, this is my first video after three weeks of no video. I should apologize to all of you for being gone as long as I have been, because, I mean, three weeks of no video, I'm not even going to try and make any excuses. Anyway, I'm back for good. Uh, I'm dedicated. I've started making videos for my personal channel again, too, because now I've just redone some things and made time for it. So, I'm back. I'm here. This channel's not dying. That's ridiculous. I don't know who's saying that, but it's not dying. I'm not going to let it die. Even if I'm the last one, which I know I wouldn't be because there's a bunch of other dedicated mem members of this channel. Uh, I'm just going to keep posting videos every week. So, yeah, it's going to keep going after this summer because I don't want it to stop. And I'm definitely going to have some more time on my hands when I go back up to school, which is how I got my start on YouTube. What would I do with a million dollars? I can't even begin to answer that question. I can tell you my most selfish aspect of that is uh, Mr. 2009 Honda Accord, just like my old one. And then I'd also keep some of the money and make my old one perfect and pristine like it was when it was brand new. And then I'd have two Honda Accords and uh, I'd park them in a garage of a modest house. And as far as the remaining somewhere over half a million dollars, um, I'd probably invest, maybe start my own company. Anyway, I'm not really sure, but that's it there. I've seen Batman twice. I really like it, actually, and I'm not that into Batman. I just, it's a fantastic movie, very entertaining. If I wanted to choose an actor to play me in a movie with me, I didn't quite get the question. It would be Jake Gyllenhaal, because I really like Jake Gyllenhaal. That's the dumbest reason in the world to uh, pick an actor for to play yourself, but I just find him very attractive, so I hope that's good enough. Mike, I got my wisdom teeth pulled about two and a half weeks ago, and look at me. I can smile, and I don't feel any pain anymore, and these holes that they left in the bottom that you have to squirt out with water, and it's really gross. Um, you just get like these impossible amounts of food out of there. And I don't know if you have to do that, too. I don't know if you got yours removed the same way or whatever. But, um, yeah, that's kind of interesting. But, anyway, no more pain. Uh, I recovered pretty fast, though, too. I got lucky, I guess. Keith, your song was absolutely amazing. <laughs> like, with the guitar. And I love it when people, like... Like, you don't ever really talk about playing the guitar. And then, boom, one day you have it out. And you play away. And it's one of those things that, like, I didn't even really realize you were that incredible at and suddenly there's amazing gu guitar playing going on and I really like it, so good. This is the part I regret talking about in this video. It's August 4th. Uh, we all know that 888 is on August 8th and if I were going, I would have been gone already but um, because I would have had to drive and I would have had to le left by now. Um, but I just don't have the money, and I have to pay for school, and so many things, and this trip, looking at a bill of around four to five hundred dollars, no matter how I do it, and I can't pay for it right now. I live far away from Toronto, and if I had the money, I'd do it, but I have to be re realistic about some of my budgeting. There's so many of you that I want to meet so bad in person, so this really sucks. <laughs> And I don't know when I'm going to do it, but maybe if I had a million dollars instead, I'd spend it on traveling around the country and the world um, to visit all of you guys one by one, make an awesome video. Anyway, I don't know. But I really regret to say that I'm not going to 888 because I planned on it for so long, but um, certain things with my budget and stuff become a reality. and. I don't know. I have other things to pay for first. And Wayne, all of your advice about keeping this channel going and how we shouldn't really worry and stuff was really cool. And I feel the same way too. Um, I don't want any of you guys to worry about my dedication because even though it seems like it hasn't been there, um, I'm not going to let this channel go. I'm not going to let it go. So I've already said that. I just keep harping on it. Also, you had questions about manual transmissions. Uh, I don't want to brag, but I'm probably the person to ask about a lot of that sort of thing. Uh, in this country, it doesn't matter. I, most uh, students in driver's education courses learn on an automatic. In fact, probably almost all the time. I learned on an automatic. It's up to like parents or whoever to teach uh, 
someone to learn to drive a manual. I drove a manual for three years until I got my new car. Um, but either way, a driver's license in this country is a driver's license, and whether it's a manual or automatic doesn't make a difference. It's all about whether you can drive one or not, um, whether you're able to without wrecking into a tree. I've been told I look like Patrick Fugit, and if you don't know who that is, um, if you've seen the movie Almost Famous, it's uh, the boy in that movie. So probably looked more like him when I was around 15 or so, but I've been told that so many times, especially since I got on YouTube. Um, I've been told that probably close to 20 times or so in my life, if I were to estimate. So I must look somewhat like him. I don't really necessarily see the resemblance, but maybe a little. Well, I better go. I'm off to replace the driver's side axle on my car, because it wore out. Because my car's got a million, billion miles on it. Uh, and that should take the rest of the day. I'm really uh, happy to be back. I'm sorry I was gone, but don't worry. Next week I'll be back again. You can count on it. Uh, so good to be talking to you guys again. Um, I, as I make the shift back into this new school year, I'll have more time to talk to all you guys again. Um, privately and in chats and whatever. So looking forward to that. Uh, looking forward, obviously, to your guys' videos. Everybody have a good week. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.